Hi, my name's David, and I'm here to show you how to create and import price list in Descara Books. So first we're going to click on Books. After that, we're going to click on Price List. Inside here, I can see the price list name, type, effective date, currency, and the status, where I can activate or inactivate it. I can click on three dots, edit, copy, and delete. If I wish to create a new one, I can click Create. Inside here, I can put in the priceless name. So maybe, for example, Jan price list. I can select the type, buy or sell. I can select the currency. So based upon my different types of multi-currency that I've selected, I can see that here and select which one. I can now select the effective date. So for example, since it's January, I'm going to go back to January 1st. Now I can add a product. So for example, maybe I want to add uh, desktop computer and let's also add a monitor then I can go here and put in the price so for example maybe I want to put it as 500 and maybe I can put this as 250 after I add in all my products I can click Save and you can see my Jan price list has been created I can also then import and export my price list so let's click import let's download the sample file and let's open it. Now we're in the price list template. Inside here I can see the price list, type, effective date, currency. You can see I can have more than one currency in a price list by the comma here. USD, SGD for example. I can see the product name, price, and price currency. You'll notice that the products start on this line after the price list name. And of course I can have buy as well. So let's create one. June. T-shirts sell for example let's put in the effective date let's just update the currency and maybe I have more products so I'm just going to insert some more lines in here I'm just going to go control and I'm going to paste it on in and then I can just actually just copy this whole price list again paste it here and I just change this to buy for example and let me just put in the price here now if I want to do another sell it's just as simple I just copy paste it and then I can just put in the price here so for example maybe it's now 70 80 90 for example control copy control paste and then I can just save it. Now inside here, I can just drag and drop the template. I can also click browse, select the file and click open. And the uploaded file should appear here. Now, if you have your own price list, you can just drag and drop into here or click browse and select it. Just make sure it's a CSV or an XLSX file. After that, I click next. And then I can see the imported file headers and the Descara headers. Inside here, I can choose which field from Discara should be mapped to which imported file header. It should be automatically selected, but if you're using your own price list, your headers may be different, so you may have to map it. And if the field is not meant to be imported, just click do not import this column. Over here we can see our effective date, and I can change the format. So for example, we're year, year, month, month, day, day, so I'm just changing it here. Then if everything looks correct, I can click next. After that, I can look at this information and see if it's all correct. For example, this should be by this. I want to be July and I want to change the effective date as well to July. Now, if I want to change the products, I can just click on this button and then I can see all my products here, price, as well as price currency and I can modify as well. After that, I can click Submit. Now you can see my July t-shirts, June t-shirts have been imported, the buy and sell. Next, let's copy a price list. Let's click on the three dots. Let's click Copy and let's put in the price list named. We can also update the type update the currency 
and let's change the effective date to August 1st. I can then also update the price here as well. After that, I can save it. Now after that, I can click the three dots and I can click edit. I can click more action and click update. This will allow me to reduce the price by a percentage or increase the price by a percentage. So for example, if I want to increase this, for example, by 10%, and if I have multiple currencies, I can select which currency to update. And then I can click update here. And now you can see the price has now been updated. And then I can click save. Next, let's click on sell. And let's create new. And let's create a new invoice. Now let's select a contact. For example, Jack's monitors. And then let's add a product item. So for example, let's add in a monitor. So I've added in a monitor. I can see the unit price based upon the state. Now, if I want to change it, for example, to June, you can see the price changes. If I change it to a May, you can see the price updates. This is all based upon your price list. So however you maintained it, it'll pick up automatically and reflect here. And that's a quick look at how to create a price list in Descara Books.